What do Harry Potter, Marie Antoinette, and the phrase down east have in common? An American original, the Maine Coon cat. The Maine Coon is the only cat that was actually developed here in, uh, where else, Maine. You see, Marie Antoinette was set to flee France with her bevy of long hair angoras. But the ship sailed down east to Maine without her. The guillotine was her next stop. One legend claims Marie's cats made it to Maine, giving rise to the modern day Maine Coon. They're enormous. They tend to be one of the bigger cats, quite dramatically large. And of all the things large and long about this cat, it's a Maine Coon that has the longest whiskers ever recorded, an amazing six and a half inches. Want to be sure you've got a Maine Coon? Check the forehead. Many of them sport an M for Maine Coon, leading us to another recognizable forehead. Harry Potter and his Hogwarts friends were under constant watch by Mrs. Norris, a Maine Coon ready to catch any student misbehaving. The Maine Coon evolved in close proximity to humans in rural coastline and farming communities. Originally bred for their mousing talents, their loving nature and kind disposition made them America's breed. They are now one of the most popular breeds, second only to Persians. This is a big cat in every way. Let's start with the measurements. They can weigh up to 25 pounds, although average weight is a hefty 17 for adult males. Expect your Maine Coon to get to 40 inches in length. The lengthiest on record, however, is 48 inches. The Maine Coon is like the Great Dane. It's the gentle giant. They have oversized paws to help navigate the snow. Big, furry, flat feet, sometimes referred to as snowshoes, often with extra digits. And finishing off with a very long, thick tail, giving them good balance, agility, and a warm wrap for catnaps in cold weather. Adult coon cats have a three-layer coat, two undercoats, and a guard coat, with coloring from white to black with various tabby patterns. The main coon is a long-haired cat, so grooming the coat is definitely a team effort. Cats spend about a third of their day grooming themselves. I think it's only fair to give them a hand, give them a little brushing. Although no major health concerns have surfaced, it's always wise to go to a reputable breeder or do your research if adopting from a shelter. This is a terrific family cat. I think it would be a very good first time cat because they are so loving and sweet. Those looking for loyal and lovable need to look no further. So to recap, the Maine Coon is strong and healthy. It's a big cat with lots to groom and wants to be a loyal member of your family. They're large, they're impressive, and they're super nice.